Hey gang, welcome back to the channel. Thanks for walking around with us today. Today we're back out at Seabrook Reflections in Nocatee. Gonna do all the models. They're getting ready to have an open house here tomorrow, so I'm trying to get a couple videos done today. And we're at a Riverside. It's a Liberty, cool home. It's a 40-foot product that I'm telling you, when you see it, you're gonna go, how's this a 40-foot product? You think this is gonna be a 50 or 60-foot product, right? When they say product, they mean house, what lot it goes on. But this Liberty, it's phenomenal. Let's go take a peek at her. All right, gang, let's go look at this Riverside Liberty. This is the C elevation. Sharon and I do appreciate you coming along today. Look at this beautiful eight foot entry door and eight, eight foot doors are standard with Riverside here. And as you come into the house, you're gonna start seeing some things that don't look like a normal 40 foot product. But before we get into the living room space and all, let's take a left and go into the powder bath right by the front door, super convenient. Very nice. Grand, uh, excuse me, quartz countertops, super cool. Um, you'll see, as we walk around, you'll see little pieces of blue tape. That's the builders, they're getting ready for a big model open house tomorrow, so the builders will come through and um, they're marking some things so that they can um, t have the painters come in and touch up, touch up the space for us. Okay, but anyway, enough of that, don't worry about that. Beautiful, this is a, a home that usually goes on a 40, or goes on a 40 foot lot. It is, this is just beautiful. You don't see a 40 foot product like this this wide open here anyway the liberty 2390 square feet four bedroom two and a half bath with a loft semi custom builder riverside is two by six walls radiant barrier in the attic space i'm a huge fan of radiant barriers the house the way it is now has been tuned up of course because it's a model it's got the professional kitchen appliances cabinets to the ceiling Beautiful, all the crown molding, all the cove, like, that's called cove crown, the way they do it up there. Ginger, their designer, which you'll go see as well if we build from scratch with Riverside, you'll see ginger as well. That's a convection microwave. That's got an, the oven's got an air fryer ability, um, plus others, I'm, stuff I don't even know. Again, Frigidaire Professional Appliances. This is a, I was just talking to Cindy, the site agent. She made a statement about their home, this home, this particular home, the Liberty, that it's a space you want to be in. Isn't that crazy? Before we go upstairs, let's do this. Let's look at the back here. Again, two by six construction. I mean, let me, let me just see if we can go out the back here. Heavy duty sliders, oh my gosh. Look at this space, huh? Wow. This is a beautiful lot as well. It backs up to other homes, but you, you can, you can imagine this on a water lot or a preserve lot. Amazing. Anyway, let's go upstairs. Check out the upstairs. Five and a quarter inch baseboards. Beautiful wood on the treads. And we have built a couple of Riverside homes for clients, Silverleaf and in, in Silverleaf, Nocatee, and a couple other smaller um, com communities. And um, we always enjoy, especially going to see Ginger to help design a house. We have a lot of good, good fun with her. She's good people. She's very smart. What do we just pass here? Let's see. That's the air handler closet. Nothing important there to see there. Nice small. That's a that's a, that's a double. Not a double. That's a queen. That's a queen. Um, Coming here. Little closet space. Not bad for. But this has an ensuite. Very nice. Fully tiled. I love this tile. I guess I should have turned the light on for us, huh? Sorry, sometimes I miss things. There we go, how about that? Now you can see that tile. Look at this. Nice loft space. And then laundry room upstairs, and good size laundry room too, for being an upstairs laundry room. This has got lots of cabinets. They, on this particular model, they have the front loaders put in. Again, that's entirely your choice. Coming down the hallway, we have our community bathroom. You can see that the secondary bathroom isn't near as tuned up with, you know, super high-end courts, super high-end fixtures. And even for a model, they don't generally do a lot of that. Most folks don't, just because you just don't need to. And we, when we help folks spec a home, we'll tell them you don't really need to put a lot of money into secondary bathrooms because at the end of this nice small small walk in here 
you just don't need to put that kind of money because you'll you won't get the money back out it won't come back and pay you dividends what oh, this is a little hall linen closet it is indeed okay you want to really put your money into your this is a lot there's a lot of light coming in here wow look at this probably a duplicate closet right there uh you want to put your money in your master and your kitchen those are the places you want to put your money you will you will get that back coming in here obviously another little linen closet there and wow wow four windows two on this side but four right in a row oh my gosh closet the size of a small bedroom here cool light fixtures simple and old school looking but very cool love the tray so i'd paint that like a haint blue i guess it is kind of a haint blue now it's just real slight all right look at this look at all that countertop amazing ginger one of ginger's specialties with riverside is bathrooms bathrooms now this one's been tuned up with this one's been um the tub has been added normally it comes with um a shower only and it, the shower is extended over to this area and then the closet door is not in the bedroom it is going to be right here all right but this one's got the tub that she has put in it and then of course our toilet space over here wow look at that i mean this is a counter space stacked drawers oh my gosh what do we got here oops see much better much nicer finishes here in the master but that's really where you want to put your money all right let's uh take you downstairs and leave you with a view of the living room again as, as you entertain as you bring folks in here and yourself when you come in you just i don't know it'd be hard pressed not to love this house man all right gang appreciate you guys coming along today to check out the liberty by riverside here in nakati seabrook reflections um if we can give you guys a hand if we can help you get into a home if we can just answer a question for you doesn't matter we love doing it all so anyway i want you to have a fantastic day thanks